Yo, what's going on guys? Dungeon is here and I'm going to show you a quick way to actually get some Z keys and everything. So the first thing you have to do is that you have to go over here to the Zation Combat and pick up the Hero's Ascent quest and also run this build and have a 4040 and this armor which I will ping. I, I will leave the template down below in the description. And it's preferable to have a PvP character when you do this. But otherwise, just go to Heroes Ascent. And we add the Illusion, the two Monks, and four Ellies. Enter Battle. And basically what you do is you just have to win two battles in Heroes Ascent. And this is pretty easy to do because... All you're going to do is go up against bots. So if you can just get pretty much all of their henchmen to be powered up, you can just quickly take them all out, pretty much. So you just take these guys out. It should be relatively easy to do. Sometimes it takes like 20 seconds. Sometimes it takes a little bit longer. But it's not too bad. Save just 19 seconds right there. And whenever you do this... It's like whenever, all you gotta do is win two battles. You get 1,500 gold, 9,000 Valve Faction, which is two Z keys, and you get 50 Copper Coins, which is a Silver Coin, which is an Ecto. And sometimes people even buy the Silver Coins for an Ecto each. Like there's a Broken Hala, someone named Broken Hala and Commandant, and they occasionally buy them for one Z key each. And basically, what we're going to do is you just make a pvp character you do you win your two battles and then you basically put everything into the chest to set the reward and then you just delete the character make another one and you can just keep doing it over and over and over again or you can do it across like other characters that you have this is that ellie seems to be the best you can also do this with a mesmer but i think that Ellie is a little bit faster, and it just takes a little bit to get into each mission. Yeah, but otherwise, this is a pretty easy way to actually get Z keys. Just do it whenever the Z combat is here as a sense. And of course, I'm going to play it through for you. And something you can do is you could, for the first five games, just win three rounds. And what that'll do for you is you'll also get like a hero strong box. Um, which I'm not really doing that because I don't think the hero strong box or boxes are really that good. Um, but you know, if you really want them, you could actually do that and you can get five of them a day. So if you already do the hero farm box, uh, farm or whatever, you can just go ahead and pick up this quest and get like additional Z keys on top of that. And I'll go ahead and show you what to do. Um, I rarely ever lose to the bots, but it occasionally happens that I will. But I usually just always win. Usually the best time to attack them is whenever they're like balled up. But if you start playing it, you'll start to get the hang of it. You might lose like a game or two or it might be kind of close. But, um, you know, you can get a lot of flawless wins on this. So basically with this map right here, I just do this. I just like pick some random guy, use this glyph, glyph. Just go like this, meteor shower, and then you just start nuking all of their guys, like this. And sometimes the heroes might die, but that's okay for the most part. Then you just keep nuking them. And you win. And a lot of times you can get like a flawless victory, which it just didn't happen that time, but a lot of times it will. Especially if you can ball them up really well and just kill them all like really quickly. Like you could see how much damage it did. And the DJC Tondra or whatever, I mean, that guy was just a bot. Like it's just always bots. And this is usually the second map the majority of the times, which is like a small map, which is good. But yeah, you pretty much just use your enchantment spell, 
then you use that, hit them with Meteor Shower, Death's Charge, and then you just start spamming these skills right here. And yeah, you can you can do some serious damage really quickly. And you get Balthazar Factor for it. And of course, the main thing we're after is the Z Combat Quest. You know, we're mainly after this one Ecto, the two Z Keys, and the 1500 gold, which is like pretty good considering how quick you can do this. Like, it literally only takes like a few minutes. And I'll also show you how quickly I can make a new PvP character because it doesn't take long at all. You can even give it some like random name. I usually just use FA Master for Fort Aspian Wood Master, but you know, it's whatever. And let's see here. So sometimes it's best to just go ahead and attack like really quickly. It seems to ball them up pretty good. Sometimes you get hit. Oh man, that's like the first time I've ever died doing this. That's weird. Let's see if I can make it through this. It's pretty unusual to actually die, so. But I think I have enough of an advantage to actually win. There we go, got that morale boost. And this one, you just go over here to the priest, meteor shower, just hit them with all your damage. Happens pretty quickly. You just win twice, then this is a com completed. Just go over here to the GTOB. Open up your chest and go over here to the Z challenge. And I've already done this a few times, as you can tell. Just go over here, accept it. Go over here to the tournament. Buy Ziki. Buy Ziki. Two Zikis. 50 copper Z coins. 1500 gold. It's really easy to do. And if you want to keep repeating it, you just log out, character select, delete, buy master. Go over here. Just pick whatever, elementalist, whatever, just give it a name, hop in there. Then you go over here, you can pick up the Z combat again. And of course you can only do this on days where Heroes Ascent is the Z combat, but it pops up quite a bit. And then you just go over here, you just uh, load the template if you have it saved. That right there, PvP equipment, well, go over here. Load from template, Ellie Nuker, go over here, Heroes Ascent, and just add in the heroes, which is, once again, Mesmer, two monks, and four Ellies. So yeah guys, that is a quick, easy way to actually get a couple of Z keys and an Ecto and 1500 Platinum. And you also get a couple of hero points, and you know, this happens like, like this is pretty quick. Like it, like it's pretty fast to do. So if you're someone and some, if you if you're someone who basically goes after the hero strong boxes or whatever, you could really consider doing this. And you don't need a PvP character, but it's preferable. So you can just keep deleting it and going back in there, because the two main characters you can use for nuking is pretty much like an Ellie and also the Mesmer. Those are the two main ones. Let's see, I think I have the Mesmer build. I'll also leave the PBX Wika build for using the hinges, because it's the hinge way. And yeah, you just use Panic Mesmer. And I'll leave the links down below, of course. But yeah, otherwise, let me know what you think. Dungeon is signing out.